JBN, we keep you informed. Missing St. James teacher found dead at home. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items. A basic school teacher who was reported missing on Monday at the Cambridge police station was discovered dead inside her house at Plum District in Cambridge, St. James on Tuesday, three days after she went missing. According to police, the body of Nicolene Brown, 43, was found in a seated position on her floor in an advanced state of decomposition. But what have you know how Nicolene did? This is one of the strangest things I ever say, said Winnell Brown, an aunt of the deceased. The last time I see Nicole, as Nicolene is also called, was Saturday morning when she come up a morning service at the church about 9.30 a.m. And she left and tell me she had go down her yard. And Saturday night, her neighbor called me and tell me say nobody don't see Nicole. And it's strange because her entire house in a darkness. Brown said that family members went to her house on Sunday, where neighbors said they saw her dressed up as if she was going out. That was when all of us start to get suspicious. And to make matters worse, Missy Nicole closed them still upon her clothesline. And that is not Nicole at all, she said. The aunt said on Monday her daughter contacted the school where Brown taught and they were informed that she did not turn up for work. So she and her son went to the house and peeped through a window, but they did not see anyone inside. They left, but were called again by a neighbor on Monday, and she informed them of a fall order coming from the direction of Brown's house. We go back at the house, and we see a trail of blood around from under our door, and at that time, they may call the police. When them come, they break off a lock for go inside, and find her upon the ground dead, she said. This is one of the strangest things I ever see. Me and Nicole very close. I mean everything about her. The police reported that after they received the call, they went to the house and found Brown in a seated position. Although there were no signs of violence seen inside the house, we have not ruled out foul play, but we'll have to wait on a post-mortem examination result to determine the cause of death, one police investigator said. Brown was described as a kind and loving person who was very secretive. She reported he lived alone in her two-apartment house in Plum District and taught at the Winners Basic School along Cottage Road in Montego Bay for several years. Following news of her death, the school community was sent into shock. JBN, we keep you informed. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.